cookout, fresh burgers, the best combos in town. That's what they say. Um, since I moved down here, I've had people tell me, you got to get cookout, you got to get cookout. They give you so much food. I don't know anything about the quality of it. I don't know how it's supposed to taste. I just know they give you a ton. And they certainly seem to. Um, what I've got here cost me $8.62. Um, it would have been $2 less had I not opted for a milkshake and cheese. Let's give it a shot here. These guys have everything imaginable that you can get. I did a burger and a chicken quesadilla. Sorry, a big double burger and a chicken quesadilla. So I haven't even looked at this yet, which I should have because that's real exciting, right? Nice foil. So everything's hot. Um, I can tell right on top. Whew, hot. Chicken quesadilla. <laughs> Let's try this thing first. This was the most interesting. Okay, so one of the sides you can get, and the way their menu works is you get one big thing, two sides, and a drink. One of the sides was called bacon wrap. It's 420 calories. I'm not gonna turn down something called bacon wrap, right? Um, I was under the impression this was in a, oh, okay. So it's a wrap. Let's take a look there. That's a wrap. It's got some lettuce, cheese. Let me take a bite. Some sort of ranch. I got no bacon, which for a full bite is a little disappointing. You can see it there. Let's try again. All right, pretty good. There's barely any bacon though. Finally getting to the bacon in the back of it. Hmm. Finish that later, but I didn't expect to be surprised or disappointed by the bacon wrap. But I am. But that's got me feeling thirsty, right? So let's grab the trusty old straw hair and try their seasonal watermelon shake. I was also told they have amazing shakes. That's the only thing I got flavor on. The shakes are good. Cook out, right? All right. Oh, so I'm not a big watermelon guy. Um, the flavor's not amazing. And there's not a lot of it, at least in the watermelons I've had. I've been told you can buy the most amazing watermelons. I don't know. This one's got watermelon flavor. Oh, and little chunks of watermelon. Can I get you a picture? Yeah. Watermelon shake. Pretty good. I'm not disappointed by that choice. So the shake cost an extra dollar. Um, before we go to our other side, let's, let's just rip open this burger. Burger costs extra, extra buck because I got it cheddar style, which includes cheese. By default, you don't get cheese. I'm a cheesy guy, I want some cheese. Poppy likes cheese, don't we all? Don't we all? Got grease on the outside of this thing. It's gonna be a mess. I got bacon coming out. That was also part of the cheddar style. Woo! The smell hits you. It's like I'm at a, it's like I'm out camping. We fired up a grill, charcoal's going. And these are burgers that you'd make there. That's the smell I get. So that's our, that's our burger. Um, cheddar style also has, oh. It's got the cheese, it's got mayo, it's got onions, if you can even see that. Honestly, I don't want to show you, I just want to dig it. Mm. It tastes like a charcoal grilled burger. Um, it's not a bad thing. 
I haven't had that flavor in a long time. It's been a while since I went camping. Mmm. Still haven't hit it with the bacon. Granted, I had enough of that in the bacon wrap, I guess. It's good. Um, I don't say there's anything to write home about, though. So what you're really getting here is the value. All this stuff for six bucks. And I say that because, well, seven. I'd get the milkshake. I don't think I'd get cheese on the burger again. I don't think I'd get a burger again. But it's not bad. I can just get better. So we'll finish that later, too. Because I got to show you one last item. And this was kind of the selling point. They go, Fappy, you can get a burger and a quesadilla as part of the same combo. Wild, right? I guess I believe it because this is a tiny little quesadilla. Honestly, I expected a big bag of food. I got this little tray I showed you. So I was like, okay. But let's try this out. Well, it's chicken, it's cheese, and it's a flour tortilla. There's no sauce of any sort, or veggies, or anything. So that needs to get dipped in something. I don't know, it's not bad. Uh, everything I've had is not bad, it's just, I guess if I'm paying six dollars for Every food imaginable under the sun is a combo. I shouldn't really expect a ton of quality, right? Um, so my recommendation is if you're really hungry and you want a random bunch of stuff, you could go to cook up. They have other things. They've got hot dogs. They've got chicken sandwiches, grilled, and a spicy crispy one. So, you know, I'll probably make it back here sometime. I'm still intrigued by how much freaking stuff they've got. There's a ton of milkshake flavors. This is really good. Um, I've never had a watermelon milkshake. I haven't had watermelon anything in so long, so this is refreshing. But, uh, yeah. Hope you like checking out Cookout with me. Uh, sorry if the video's coming off. I left the AC going. It's hot out. I don't know how that sounds. I'll go listen to it later. Um, this was a request by the fat hipster. Um, he said, do the cookout video. And I uh, kept looking at the menu like, no, no, not today, not today. But today, I don't know, I felt like hungover almost. I didn't touch any beer or anything. I just didn't feel good. I felt like hungover, stomach, super hungry, headache. And I said, you know what? I think cookout's for drunk and hungover people. I'm going to get some cookout. So that's what we did. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you liked it, please subscribe, like the video, leave a comment, let me know what you thought. Let me know if you like Cookout, if you have a favorite combo I should be getting, because it wasn't that. Um, but yeah, thanks. Take care, guys.